Sometimes in our lives, there are events that would not have occurred to even the most brilliant screenwriters, and so it is not surprising that movies based on real events are so attractive to viewers. And if you are interested in such projects, here are a few good movies that are definitely worth watching. Number 1. Air Sports drama, where the director and the performer of one of the roles, was Ben Affleck. According to the plot, the action takes place in the mid-80s. Nike is going through bad times, so marketing manager Matt Damon decides to completely change the concept and create sneakers inspired by Michael Jordan and basketball in general. In words, it's a typical success story, but Affleck's movie just promises to showcase everything that is usually hidden in the shadows. How chance and risk blind faith and, of course, the human element helped seal the deal. The main advantage of the movie is that it does not look like another project with a dozen Hollywood stars in the cast. On the contrary, it's a rather witty and audience-pleasing movie about an era and faith in one's own vision. You got a name for it? Air Jordan. I don't know. Seriously? Well, maybe it'll grow on me. Number 2. Zillion. The movie is based on true events and will tell the story of the rise and fall from the famous Belgian nightclub Zillion. The action takes place in the 2000 years when nightclubs reigned complete freedom. The plot tells the story of Frank Verstraten, a brilliant a guy who loves nightclubs, but because of his peculiar appearance, he often fails to pass face control. After one such incident, he decides to start his own club. Here freely circulate sex, drugs, techno, and big money. The protagonist goes in search of fame and pleasure, which is almost impossible to buy. Together with the porn king of Belgium, Frank manages to build a whole club empire, the sunset of which will be as rapid as his promising beginning was. Number 3. Cocaine Bear it is worth starting with the fact that the movie will be known long before the release. The most interesting thing is that all this is not a sick fantasy of the screenwriter. After all, the picture is based on a real story about an unsuccessful drug smuggling. In 1985, during a parachute jump, one of the drug couriers dies. The fallen in the reserve package with cocaine is eaten by a bear and opens a hunt for everyone who catches her eye. The huge predator with white powder on its muzzle breaks the laws of physics and ingeniously kills innocent people. In reality, no one knows exactly what the beast was doing with the find. However, the authors decided to fantasize. What if Grizzly managed before his death to arrange a bloody massacre in the neighborhood? That's exactly what happens in the eccentric thriller comedy. Number 4. Boston Strangler an American crime project based on the true story of a serial maniac nicknamed the Boston Strangler. The movie is a mixture of David Fincher's thrillers and Madman series. It is a dark retro detective about a complex era and its unsung heroine. The plot centers on newspaper reporter Loreto McLaughlin, who becomes the first journalist to be linked to the murder of the Boston Strangler in the 1960s. As the serial maniac's death toll rises, Laredo tries to investigate the case with her co-worker and part-time confidant, but the pair find themselves at an impasse due to the pronounced sexism of the era. Despite all the difficulties, the women continue to do their work, putting themselves in great danger and risking their own lives. A safe little world is just delusion. Number 5. Tetris The movie tells the complicated story of the creation of one of the most popular games in the history of mankind. In the center of the plot will be a video game seller Hank Rogers who in the 80s decides to get the global rights to distribute the puzzle game Tetris. Developed by Soviet programmer Alexei Pajit Hitnov, Rogers goes to a closed country to sign a contract with the developer but meets resistance from the government. It resents the arrogance of a Western capitalist who has decided that money can buy everything. The game not only becomes instantly popular all over the world but also provokes scandals resulting in a series of lawsuits. Tetris is the new movie by John S. Baird, the director of the much-loved movie Filth. The novelty will probably not achieve the same fame, but it will definitely brighten up the audience's evening. We don't have time. I have a plan. Oh, come on. You guys are the kings of cliffhangers. Number 6. Argentina 1985 political thriller and true story, which is a reconstruction of a high-profile trial. In the mid-80s, after a coup d'etat, the leaders of the junta are in the dock. The military, who have been running the country for the last seven years, 
Young lawyers are tasked with putting together a case to bring yesterday's power to justice. However, it is almost impossible to do so. Citizens are still afraid of reprisals and therefore reluctant to tell the truth. In addition, corruption and attempts to intimidate honest people are still strong in the country. Argentina 1985 is the hit of the year and was sent to represent the country at the Academy Awards. Also, it is not only full of suspense and legal procedures, but it is also an uplifting movie about the fact that sooner or later the law will prevail. Number 7. True Spirit Here we have a good old biographical movie about the exploits of real people. It's an adaptation of the incredible journey of Australian Jessica Watson, who at the age of 16 set sail around the world on her bright pink yacht. Despite the naysayers, who predicted the girl an embarrassing failure, Jessica pulled it off and returned home after 210 days. The movie will tell at what cost the girl achieved the impressive result. True Spirit is somewhat predictable and secondary, but still a spectacular story of dedication and determination that proves once again that you should never judge a person by their age. I'm Jessica Watson. I'm tough and I'm struggling. But that's okay. Cause we made it. Number 8. Campen o Narvik The movie is based on real historical events that took place in Norway during World War II. In 1940, a small Norwegian town, Narvik, caught the eyes of the world community. This settlement is an important strategic object, necessary for the German industry and more precisely for the transportation of iron ore, necessary for military equipment. Nazi Germany begins a large-scale operation, the purpose of which is to take control not only of Narvik, but the whole of Norway. The German army wanted to fulfill the task as early as possible, but for two months of bloody battles, the fascists were destined to suffer their first defeat. That's exactly the background of these dramatic events and will develop the plot, where the war is gaining momentum and takes more and more human lives. Number 9. D1C Conference the film is a military historical drama, the action of which takes place on January 20, 42nd. The leading representatives of the Nazi regime of Germany gathered at a villa in Berlin. This meeting went down in history as the Wannsee Conference, where it was decided to systematically kill 11 million Jews. The movie supremely demonstrates such a phenomenon as the banality of evil. At the same time, by fully embracing a monstrous ideology, they created a system that led to the brutal deaths of millions of innocent people. The film perfectly demonstrates how seemingly even the most horrible and immoral things can become completely bureaucratized in a society consumed by intolerance and the illusion of superiority. Friedlich. Sehr. Number 10. Big George Foreman. The plot tells about one of the greatest comeback in the history of sports. Having a poor childhood, the hero did everything to become the first. Grueling labor and unimaginable, willpower led him to Olympic gold and the title of world champion in heavyweight. Finding himself on the verge of death, Foreman is forced to leave the sport. A dire financial situation and a life crisis force him to fight for his place, no matter what. Incredibly, Foreman regains his title and becomes the oldest world champion in boxing history. Number 11. The Swimmers British-American sports drama and the real story of Syrian sisters of athletes who dream of Olympic gold. Since childhood, they have been active in swimming and dreamed of conquering the Olympic podium together. In 2015, an armed conflict broke out in their native Syria and all the ambitious plans of ambitious athletes were threatened with failure. The girls decide to take a desperate step and set off on a journey to Europe full of dangerous adventures. A year later, after a difficult ordeal, one of the sisters gets the opportunity to take part in the Summer Olympics in 16. The girl will go to the most long-awaited start in life under the flag of the Olympic refugee team. These were movies based on true events. And if you like this video, then don't forget to put likes and subscribe to the channel and click on the bell. And good luck to everyone.